Hey fire signs and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your weekend love reading for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. I thought I just had a card flip in there. Yep, I did. Nice, the Six of Wands. So, um, finding victory. Um, your um, you could possibly be recognized like as a public figure. Um, you could be, your popularity is rising. The Three of Swords, getting over heartbreak. Let's see what else we got for this weekend. The Four of Swords in reverse. The person you are dealing with. Whoa. They have the Six of Pentacles in reverse. The Six of Swords in the upright. One more for the person you're dealing with. The King of Pentacles. Your guys' outcome for the weekend. The Empress. The Six of Cups in reverse. And the Prince of Pentacles. Your guys' bottom of the deck is the Devil in reverse. I gotta move these over just a minute. I'm sorry. There we go. The Devil in reverse, clarified by the Five of Swords and the Hermit in reverse. Okay. Let's see what we got going on here. Since I'm doing the whole weekend at once, I think I'll use clarifiers for these. So um, you guys have successfully moved on from somebody uh, that really broke your heart in the past. Yeah, you really fought hard for this relationship. You fought um, to, to be successful with this person, but this person just wasn't ready to commit fully to you. Um, you're kind of uh, feeling like, well, you, I gave you a chance. Now I got to move forward. I got to move on for myself. Uh, yeah, they could be trying to reach out to you um, this weekend, but you are just, you're not really, um, you don't really care is what I'm feeling. Why is the four swords in reverse here? You have taken the time to heal. You're coming out of this pause that you are taking, um, that it took you to get over this heartbreak with the three swords in reverse. And you could be uh, delivering that message to them that, sorry, I'm glad you're available now, but I don't really care type of energy. The person you are dealing with is reaching out to let you know that no one else is in the picture anymore. Um, they were splitting their energy between you and somebody else in the past. And they're letting you know with the Six of Swords that they are moving on from that. That they want to move towards you. Um, you could be dealing with an Earth sign here with the King of Pentacles. But um, let's see what we got. Why is the Six of Swords here? Strength. Could be dealing with a Leo. Um, but this is just, it took them a lot to move from where they're at. It took them a lot of courage. It took them a lot to um, actually get up and move. Like, to actually, um, yeah, to actually move away from the situation that they were very stable in. They financially, they, um, they're taking a risk by leaving. Yeah. Because they're no longer allowing their fear, their thoughts to, um, cloud their decision on where they're going. And they're no longer wanting to sneak around with you. They want a real relationship. They want a real commitment where they can um, move forward with you. <clears throat> in your outcome with the Empress, the Six of Cups in reverse. So they're leaving somebody that they have children with, for some of you, to try to create something with you. And they are coming towards you this weekend with an offer. Let's see what they want to create with you. Page of Cups in the reverse. So they are wanting to leave behind 
that third party energy and they want a new beginning, a fresh start. The Empress is the three card as well. So they're wanting to put that in the past and to move forward with you because they're no longer juggling any other person. They were trying to juggle you with somebody they had children with or somebody they had been committed to for a long time. And they're wanting you to know that they're no longer going to do that. Wow. With the three of pentacles in reverse, just over and over again, it keeps stating that this third party is ended. What they come towards you with is, uh, is something solid, something grounded, something that you can, um, something that you can have as a fresh start, a new beginning. Uh, they had to leave a toxic situation for some of them. They had to beat an addiction or, uh, or something that they felt tied and bound to. For a lot of you guys, this is, uh, they had to leave a toxic relationship that they were in in order to give to you. Um, they walked, they picked up and walked away. They're leaving everything behind their possessions, their everything to walk away towards you because in their time away from you, they have found the light. They have found what, what they feel they're meant to be doing. And that's moving towards you. What, what's the devil here for? Yeah. Wow. Look at that. The eight of cups. They're walking away from a toxic situation. They're walking away from a relationship that no longer serves them so they can be with you. Why is the five of swords here? <laughs> Yeah, they're walking away and choosing love. For sure, walking away and choosing love. Why is the hermit here? They're leaving that toxic energy. They're walking away from it this weekend. Wow. <laughs> Clarifying the hermit. They're walking away from that toxic relationship to offer you a stable, committed union. To offer you uh, a spiritual connection that they found while they were in this time of separation after they went within, they decided that they had to break free from this toxic energy with the devil. Either that or this is you, uh, fire science. It can go both ways. Um, you are walking away and choosing love. I'm sorry. Phone's ringing. You are walking away and choosing the spiritual or the partner that you feel you have a spiritual connection with. Bottom of the deck is judgment. You're going to ask for a second chance, fire sign, to somebody or somebody is coming forward and asking you for a second chance, letting you know that they've left that third party energy. They beat that toxic uh, situation. They have now freed themselves and are coming towards you or you are coming towards them. Whichever side of the energy you're on, uh, second chances are here for you guys this weekend. So I hope you guys have a beautiful week. Next time. God bless.